hi you guys welcome to my channel i am amaya and this is amaya's world of colors if this is your first time coming to hang out with me hey if this is not your first time coming to hang out with me are you subscribed did you like my last video i do it i do you like me <laughs> But if you didn't, go ahead and do that. <laughs> no, but you guys. So, hey, I got something new. And of course, I want to share it with you guys. I have purchased my first Dreamer Design Canvases. Yay! <laughs> I know, I know, Dreamer Designs have been around for a long time. And I just, you know, I just wasn't drawn to them very much, but I always pay attention. Of course, you know, you gotta be in the loop. So I always pay attention. And these two were a part of their new releases um, a few weeks ago. And I just kept watching them and kept watching them and kept watching them. And, you know, I just bit the bullet and went on ahead and got them, you guys. So that's what I'm going to share with you. In this video, I am only going to share one. And then I'm going to share the other one. You guys definitely have to bring it on back to come see that other canvas. That's why I was talking about being subscribed so that you don't miss it, you know? <laughs> but let's start the stop the rambling you guys and let's take a look at this canvas okay you guys let's get into it again i am super psyched about this canvas uh my first dreamer designs diamond painting i'm super excited let's see what i got oh it's big so Hopefully y'all can see that it is City of Swords. It's a 60 by 80 centimeter canvas. And that is a image, a close up on the image there. Oh my gosh, you guys, I am so excited. This is a new, it, Dreamer Designs has been around for a long time, but this is my first canvas from them. I ordered two. That sec, the other one will be in a different video, unboxing video, so stay tuned for that. Um, I'm not going to go into the details about everything that's that you guys already know. Of course, it has a handle. Some people love it. Some people don't. But let's get into it. Oh, I'm so excited. All right, let's take a look. Oh, oh, yeah, that's different. Okay. Oh, it's kind of in there. Okay, so it comes in a nice bag here that I like, it's a reusable bag. And then we have the toolkit. So because this is my first time unboxing one of these on my channel, I am going to take a look at the toolkit. And because this is my first time taking a look at it myself. So let's open it up. Okay, oh, purple, y'all know I love purple. But here we go. Okay, so something else is in there. Okay, so we have a standard diamond painting pin. We have two purple wax containers. Then we have a, uh, I believe this is a three placer. It's one of those thicker ones though, one of the thicker ones. And then we have a bag of baggies, a purple squishy. Oh, we have some dividers, you guys. I've always wanted these. I've just never been wanting, I've never tried it myself. But we have another diamond painting pen. Oh, that's interesting. It has like the tip of a crayon. Can y'all see that? No, you can't. There we go. It likes to have a tip like a crayon. That's cool. Maybe you can use those for your ABs. But comes with tweezers, um, a little brush. I know that this is to kind of brush the drills out when they get stubborn, they don't want to come out. So it comes with one of those. It comes with a straightener. Then also, I believe this is a, what is that a six, seven or six placer? And this also is one of the thick ones. So one of the things that I like about the tray is you guys, is that it comes with these dividers. Like I definitely like that. So you can have multiple colors in one tray and it has a little slot here to where you can pour the drills out. I like that. Okay, now let's get into this canvas. Just gonna push, push, push everything to the side and let's get into it. Ooh, that velvety back, like Diamond Art Club, it does have a really soft back. It comes with a purple bow wrapped around it. Let's see. Okay, which way does it go, you guys? I think it's this way. 
Okay, you ready? Let's take a look. Oh my goodness. Look at that rainbow. Look at all of the um flying horses. Oh man, can y'all see that? I can't see. I have my camera higher than I normally do. You know, you guys, if you don't know, I'm short. So, but look. Don't worry, I will definitely do a pin over of the canvas. Sorry, you guys, my drills are dropping everywhere. Okay, so let's turn it this way for the sake of the video until we do the pan over so you can see more of that beautiful image. Okay, you guys. Um, all right, so let's go ahead and take a look at what else comes in the canvas. Um, in with the canvas, excuse me. So here's another, it's a smaller sticker sheet. It has 60 colors um, with two, four, five ABs. And it comes with some extra stickers here. I'll just give those to my daughters. City of Swords, that image is so pretty y'all. So, so pretty. Okay, so let's get into the drills. So it comes with two packs of drills. I like that it is labeled. This is the first one, two, one, and then two, two. Um, this is the square, if I haven't mentioned before. The drills look pretty good. The drills actually look really good. Okay, I'm not gonna take them out, you guys. You know, I don't, I don't take them out, but I will find the ABs, and we'll take a look at those and see where they go on the canvas. This color right here, baby, is so pretty. Can y'all see that? Yes, it's so pretty. All right, let's go ahead and open this pack. I think the ABs are in this one. I thought they were. I thought, okay, here's one AB. Oh, well, here's, okay, yeah, yeah. Here, here are the ABs right here. Oh, I like that they're all together. Oh, they're all together. I love that. Okay, so here's the first AB. That color is so pretty. That is AB996. This one, AB798. Another shade of blue. Then uh, this is 742, that pretty, pretty orange. Then we have AB08, which is a white AB. Have AB07, a yellow. And that's it for the ABs. Let me count them. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, those are all the ABs. So we'll take, let's take a look and see if we can find where these go. I'm just gonna toss this on the floor real quick. Okay, so I do, I do want to mention you guys, I am looking at the canvas. I'm gonna turn it back this way here so you're not gonna see all of it. But I want to point out a couple of things. So um I'm a little concerned with how how much detail I feel like I'm losing. So if you see here, the horse here, the flying horse, I don't know if they're called Pegasus or whatever, but um, you can't really tell you guys what this is. Like, let me bring it up. You can't see what that is. And then here on the horse, there should be like a knight you can see kind of like the outline here of him, but it's really hard to see. Um, yeah, so I'm really concerned with the horses, you guys, the flying horses. I don't know if it's going to come out better when I actually work on the canvas. This is a square canvas, so I may end up getting some of those details that I feel like I'm losing by just straight looking at the canvas. But um, I, I will give it a shot, absolutely. Um, I just feel like I'm losing a little bit here when it comes to the detail. So let's look at the sticker. Okay, so where is it? Where is it on the sticker? Okay, so, well, this may be a canvas that would have benefited more if it was a lot larger. Because even if you look at, on the sticker, you guys, those horses are a lot smaller. So it may have been rendered a lot better if the canvas was a bigger size. But I do love, love it though. I do love the image. The, the symbols are super clear. Can you guys see that? 
I don't see any symbols that I will be tripped up on that are too similar. Um, this The canvas looks great though. Let's check this stick here. Very sticky. The plastic is a thicker type of plastic, which I do like. Um, but yeah. All right, let's try to find where these ABs are gonna go. Sorry, I threw them on the floor. Okay, so first let's find this one. It's pretty blue. This is number 60, so it's like a sideways A. Um, It doesn't pop it out at me right away. Oh, okay, uh, so I see some here in this area here. There. Um, I, It's not very many in this bag. I'm not seeing them really pop out at me anywhere else oh okay here's some here in this area here and throughout this area okay so let's move on let's look at this blue here this is back says 59 so it is charted as the plus so right off i see it here there's some in this horse here i see some over here um, I was, was thinking that it was going to be some ABs in this rainbow, but none of the blue so far. There's some down here, this area here, this area here. There's some plus signs there and here. Okay, let's move on. So the next one is the orange, and that's number 58. It is charted as three little dots. Oh, again, it's not in the rainbow. This I may use this as an opportunity to bling this canvas up, y'all. Oh, okay, wait a minute. I spoke too soon. Here's some here. In this little section here of the rainbow, there's that AB there. And there's some up here around these horses here. Can you see that? Let me zoom in a little bit. We have them here. Okay, let's zoom you back out. Alrighty. Okay, next AB is the white AB number 57. And that is charted as a, um, a letter O. So right off, I see it here in this area. I see it here. There's some sprinkled here. Um, There's none in the moon. There's some here on the uh, wings of the horse. Can y'all see that? Nope, there you go. Some here, there. Uh, okay, so there's some here in the doves, the O symbol here. There's some all throughout the wings of the doves. There's some here and on these as well. Okay. Alrighty, let's keep looking. So we have our last AB here, which is this yellow one. And it is charted as a curly Q is what I call it. So the curly Q is here. Can y'all see that? It's charted here in this area. Let's zoom you back out. There's some up here in this area here. What is this, you guys? Is that a fire? Where's my original sticker? Is that a fire? Oh, I can't tell. Can you guys tell what that is? Is that fire in the background right there? Probably just the reflections of the sky, huh? In the sky? Maybe not. It's just probably like a little reflection. Um, uh, and again, I don't see any in the rainbow. There's a little tiny dot right here. Little area right there. But as far as the colors in the rainbow, there aren't any in the rainbow. So I'm thinking, you guys, what I may do... I may end up blinking this whole rainbow out. Maybe crystals or maybe some bubble drills from DP with sparklers. Oh, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. What do you think I should do? Should I do the rainbow all crystal or AB or maybe do something fancy <laughs> and get some bubble drills? What do y'all think? Yeah, let me know in the comments what do you think I should do with that because I definitely feel like this is a great opportunity for blinging with that rainbow. Let me know what you guys think. 
So let me know, do you guys love Dreamer Designs? How many Dreamer Designs kits do you have in your stash? What's your favorite artist for them? Yeah, let put that stuff in the comments for me, you guys. So let's go ahead and do the pan over of the canvas. And until the next one, I will see you guys later. Bye. Thank you.